Hi, this is Josh with PharmacistTips.com. We're going to talk a little bit about finding the cheapest blood glucose meter and test strips. What is the most cost-effective way to monitor your blood sugar and your diabetes? First off, we want to consider some things before you start looking into it. Do you have insurance? This is uh, for the folks here in the U.S. Do you have insurance? Medicare Part B, if you are diagnosed with diabetes, will pay for a portion of your test strips. And if you have a supplement, the full cost of the test strips are most likely covered. You can talk to your doctor as well as your pharmacist to see if you would be eligible for that. It does require a doctor's prescription, although test strips can be purchased without a prescription. To bill Medicare, it's required that they be on a doctor's order, but it is possible you can get them at no out-of-pocket cost for you. Private health insurance, um, working folks with their um, insurance through their employer or if they purchase insurance on their own. The insurance may cover test strips. Probably they have what's known as a formulary though. They have a preferred test strip that they want you to use. So you'd be best to check with them, see if there is a specific brand of test strip that your health insurance covers and find out what that is. And you could talk to your doctor or pharmacist, see if you think that one will work for you. And then on top of that, many manufacturers offer a copay savings card that you could use on top of your private health insurance to bring that price down even lower. And sometimes it's even no out-of-pocket out of cost to you. All right, so the rest of the video we are gonna spend on talking, uh, we're gonna talk about the cash price, what you pay at the pharmacy. We're of course gonna look at what would you consider as generic um, blood sugar meters or store brand meters. There are no way inferior. These I've tried all the meters we're gonna talk about today and I've had good results with them. So first we'll talk about the CVS Health Advantage uh, blood glucose meter. Meter itself gonna run you about $16.49 at the time of I'm making this video. Of course the price could change, but at this time it's about $16.50. Strips run 1599 100 that's a pretty good price. That, so that's 16 cents per strip. So each test will cost you out of pocket without insurance, 16 cents. It's available in the CVS stores as well as online. Uh, the, and that's again, the CVS Health store brand monitor. Rely on Prime is a store brand meter by Walmart. The meter itself, $9, really, really inexpensive. That meter does not come with the Lancet device or test strip, so you would have to purchase those separately. At, they're real reasonably priced as well. Test strips for this meter run $17.88 per 100, so real low price of 18 cents per test or per strip. This is available online as well as in Walmart stores. Uh, a, more, a newer uh, store brand meter from Walmart is called their Rely on Premier. Um, the comp I've tried the compact. I've yet to try the voice or the blue. The compact, if you've never tested blood sugar and you want to get started, this may be uh, the best way to go because you get the meter, you get the Lancet device, and you get 50 test strips for under 20 bucks or after taxes, it'll be a little over 20 bucks. That's a pretty inexpensive way to get started on testing your blood sugar. The voice meter is about 15 bucks. The blue meter, $19. Uh, these other meters, they just have more functions. The compact is a very simple meter. It just, it only stores the last 10 uh, blood sugar results. So no fancy bells or whistles, just straightforward checking your blood sugar, easy to use. Test strip, these three meters use the same test strips. They use the Premier test strips. They run at the time of this video at $17.88 per hundred. So 18 cents per strip. Again, really, really reasonably priced. Um, so that could be an option for you as well. Lastly, I'm going to talk about the true metrics. True metrics. The nice thing about true metrics is that it's available at pharmacies throughout the United States. So the first two meters or the first three meters we talked about, those were only available at CVS or only available at Walmart. True metrics you can find at almost any pharmacy in the US. Um, meters, the price of a meter does vary. I've seen them anywhere as inexpensive as $9 up to $20. But the really nice thing, most true metrics meters have a rebate where you can get the purchase price of that meter back. So that is kind of nice for those of you on a tight budget, you can get reimbursed. The strips, the prices of strips varies greatly. 
uh, the che- you're going to pay more in store, but I saw them on Amazon for $17 a hundred. So 17 cents per test strip, right in line with the previous test strips that we talked about. Again, price varies. True metrics uh, is also covered by many insurances. So if you get a prescription for it, um, uh, all or part of that cost may be covered. And again, really nice that this is available at most U.S. pharmacies. I do have uh, videos available on the True Metrics Go as well as the plain True Metrics meter if you want to look and see those in action. Easy to use, um, and it's it's a nice meter. All these meters I've tried, I, I would use them interchangeably. Whatever one you think you can get close to your house, or if you travel a lot, maybe the True Metrics would be better simply because you may not always be near a Walmart or a CVS, but any of these meters would be a good place to start. I do hope that you uh, enjoyed this video. I thank you for watching. Ask any questions you may have in the comments below. If you found other meters at a reasonable price, let us know and we can uh, chat about that. Remember, blood sugar readings uh, need to be shared with your doctor or your primary care provider. Uh, may give them insight into your diabetes, or your prediabetes. Um, let you know how your treatment is working, let, let you know if there's some areas for improvement. Keep a good log, keep a write down in relationship to when you ate as like if the reading was after breakfast, before breakfast, af after exercise. Keep all that in a log and then when you talk to your healthcare provider, they can kind of uh, see if there's some room for improvement in managing your diabetes. Again, uh, any questions? <laughs> Must be important. I put that one in there twice. Any questions, ask below in the comments and subscribe to my channel. I appreciate you watching. Thank you.